Hey guys, welcome to a Red Rock slash Summerlin tour here today. We are just going to be showing you a little bit about Summerlin starting up here at the beautiful Red Rock Canyon. As you take West Charleston Boulevard up, you will notice once you cross over the 215 that the front gate is a short drive and that street turns into Red Rock Canyon where you will find the front gate. There are about 26 hikes that you will find in Red Rock Canyon that are from easy, moderate, and hard. There's also a 13 mile scenic drive tour that would be really fun to take if you maybe had a, rented a convertible vehicle and took the scenic drive around early in the morning. It will offer some beautiful views. So as we mentioned before, Red Rock Canyon is only a short drive from downtown Summerlin and it's a short ride right back into town. Once you cross that 215 freeway, you will see Red Rock Resort and Casino off into the right hand side. So here you could see us coming up through one of the main entrances and we can't wait to show you what's inside. We're here at the front entrance or one of the front entrances of Red Rock Casino and I'm going to show you the side view of Lotus of Siam. It's super cute, one of their really good restaurants here. So front door over there is to Red Rock and then over here is where you will see Lotus of Siam. Take a look at the outdoor decor. You can only imagine what it looks like in the inside. Actually inside of the casino and this is the interior exterior of Lotus of Siam. So beautiful. All right, guys, so Lotus of Siam is right behind me, followed by an oyster bar with plenty of casino games on the casino floor. As you can see, the machines behind me as I walk. And it just wouldn't be a casino without any bars, right? And that's what you see to my left. Next on our list is downtown Summerlin, which is only around the corner from the resort and casino in downtown Summerlin where they feature tons of community events on top of shopping, fine dining. They are really good at putting on farmers markets during the weekends as well as different a variety of community events like during Halloween and Christmas time. It's really fun to get out here, shop, eat, and just get involved in the community. So we are going to show you a little bit of what downtown Summerlin is like. Here is something for the kiddos. A nice lucky climber, mostly in the shade. Others up there, but it really helps uh, kids play outside, be involved with other kids in their community, and not get burned while trying to have some fun, right? So this space right behind me is usually where you will see a bunch of vendors for the farmer's market on the weekend. So if you're out here, this is definitely the place that you want to be to get all your fresh fruits, veggies, arts, crafts, things for dogs and kids, just all kinds of stuff. It's definitely a lot of fun and I personally highly recommend it. This part is for all my fitness enthusiasts, which is called The Lawn. If you are into yoga or just being physically fit, my even my friend Alan Jerome from 8 Strikes will host uh, boxing classes out here and he it it those events basically bring the heat sometimes you'll see anywhere from you know 50 to 100 people just out here working on their fitness on the lawn so i just wanted to show that to you so you can realize that not only can you get a good healthy meal do a little bit of shopping you can also get your exercise on check out the aerial view from the second floor as we take a short walk down just so you can see what the top floor looks like as it pertains to shopping and all the different stores you could find here at downtown Summerlin. That completes our tour of downtown Summerlin. We are going to walk over to the Las Vegas ballpark to show you where you can catch a baseball game and some other really cool events. There is such a short distance between downtown Summerlin and the ballpark, which makes it really convenient to bring out the family and have a lot of fun. 
here you could bring the family down, catch a ball game. They also have watch parties. Like recently, they were having uh, several watch parties for all the games for the Golden Knights when they were playing in the Stanley Cup. And you will also find other holiday events like Enchant, which is a really big Christmas event. This was actually the first location that they launched it at. And the second one you can find at on the, on the strip at Resorts World Casino. But definitely come on down, enjoy a baseball game and grab some beer and have fun. Thanks for walking around with me during this Summerlin tour. I hope you enjoyed viewing not only Red Rock Canyon, but Red Rock Casino, downtown Summerlin, as well as the ballpark. As you can see behind me, they are showing the times for the Aviators uh, baseball game. So feel free to check those out. And I really hope that you enjoyed this tour. If you did, feel free to like, subscribe, and share it with somebody who you think might find value from this tour. And we'll see you at the next one.